Uh, welcome back to Archer and Malta. I'm Ray. I'm Tony. And it's been a while since we've done a video. It again. Has. It has. Lots of stuff happening again in yeah. the background. We are going to try and now commit to every Wednesday uh, uploading the video. So we'll try and keep a regular schedule to at least we stop uh, having big gaps between the episodes. I mean, it got really difficult because I was working hand up. Yep. And with the airplanes and the guns, it was almost impossible to do a vid day. Um, exactly. So... Well, hopefully a bit better if we actually invested in some microphones. So hopefully the yep. sound quality is a bit better this time around. Do let us know in the comments if it's gotten better. For this week, as Tony just mentioned hand up, we'll start with that. Unfortunately, we have just this week actually closed the hand up range. Um, not something we wanted to do, but unfortunately it just wasn't justifiable keeping the, the second range open for the time being. However, we have managed to come to an agreement uh, with the owners there. We can still use it as a tournament space. So for our tournaments that we do throughout the year, we'll still be doing them and over at Yep. So we'll have an MFAA one. And an uh, SOA one. An uh, SOA one. And then we have the Nate Memorial one yep, in, in December, December, which we'll do again December as well. 13th. Exactly. Yeah. So yeah, so there's that. San Juan remains open, yep. obviously as normal. And from tomorrow, we'll actually start transferring a lot of the stuff over from Handa to here. So for those of you who enjoyed shooting all of the 3D animals we had at Handa, you'll now have the opportunity to shoot them on this side. Up as close well. too. <laughs> up close and personal. Well, we'll still we'll put the deer and the bear up at the back. back corner, whilst, yeah. uh, the raccoons and stuff, you'll be able to shoot a bit closer this time around. Yeah. Other than that, we also were supposed to have our kayaking event at the weekend. Unfortunately, the weather decided against us. Uh, we had very high sea swells and quite a bit of wind which unfortunately made it a bit too dangerous. Um, sad, but, you know, safety first. Yeah, it's postponed, so, it's not cancelled. Exactly. So. We will be doing it again. Uh, we are in talks with our kayaking friends, and hopefully we'll have a new date for the kayaking. Hopefully we get to do it within the next two to three weeks. Cool, cool. Which I'm looking forward to. For July, um, I won't actually be here. Um, so for bookings, you can either use the system as normal, or you can contact either Lawrence or Tony or yep. Johan, as I shall be away filming. Sounds as good. I'm going to be an extra in the Gladiator film. Hopefully, get to do some archery in that. That should be a fun experience. Excellent. Other than that, we did get restocked in a lot of arrows, both wood and carbon. So mm -hmm. if you're needing anything made up, do let us know. We Actually, just... the new carbons are going really well. Okay? Really well. The feedback on them has um, been very positive. Yeah. Nice colours. Uh, yeah, ones. nice shot. Yeah. So. Bit of a strange colour combo. We're, uh, it works, but. Yeah. We also have the Bear Paw Port Oxford Cedar back in stock. Oh, they got it at last. Yeah. Cool. Not quite as powerful a smell as previous ones. Yeah. But well, nice it's ones. a better wood because it's tight grained. Yeah, and I do. You can't see the grain in the text. No, the wood. I love these tips as well. Yeah, they're better. These are the screw-on ones. They're screw tapered. On yeah. You actually don't even need to use glue for yep. these ones. They're that powerful. So yeah, they're good. Great. They're so, good. Well stocked on these. Um, what was the other change? Yeah, Wednesdays at San Juan is going to be a day where Tony's always going to be available. So yep. he's going to be here for anyone who needs new strings or a new serving. serving, or silencers, or any string-related assistance. Yeah. Or blade-related Or assistance. knives, so if you need your knife you sharpened. sharpened. Yeah, so we'll see a lot more uh, band-aids getting yeah, used Yeah, getting shortly. around, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's my badge of honor, usually. People with band-aids on uh, their fingers after I sharpen the knives. Speaking of badges, thank you, nice segue. Um, for those who've been with us for a while, you remember, I think last year, the year before, you know, we, 2000 and in a while. 2019. 2019. Three years, three years ago. We used to have uh, digital badges that you could earn by completing certain challenges. We're going to bring that back with a twist. This time they're actually going to be physical badges like uh, patches that you can actually sew on to your t-shirt or your hoodies. Uh, we'll be starting with four in the next coming weeks. So stay tuned for that. And, and they're see. not going to be easy. No. Unlike some of the badges the first time round, this yeah. one, you really will have to earn it. it. Yeah. 
big time. Um, Tony is going to be helping me setting the difficulty of the challenges. <laughs> and well, if you don't know by now, he's a lot more sadistic than I am. So the challenges will be very, very, very difficult, but achievable. Yeah. There will be nothing. Well, I'll try and shoot on myself. There'll be actually, nothing impossible. So. Yeah. So uh, anything else we had for this week? I don't think we do. No. Mm, All right. Possible. So we'll see you next Wednesday, I guess. We'll see you next Wednesday. If there's any topics you guys would like to see us cover, uh, leave a message in the comments. We're happy to go over anything. String maintenance, yep. bow maintenance, tuning, different styles of shooting. Let us know. Yep. On that, see you next week. Adios. <sighs> Have a quick squeeze of it and make sure we've got the audio.